But out for a second. Now it's held on to and pushed along by Angelina Thorson, one of the fabulous freshmen for the Tigers this year on the LSU side as that one is stubbed over the top of the cage way high and wide. That was a clean look inside the 18 there early on here for LSU. Lusteau got some soft help there. Estes on top of Herman's Doter. Big left-footed boot, didn't have much curl on it. And well wide of the cage. Already the balls that have been pushed forward have been challenged tightly. Tigers on side, Hilton in, gives it a go, and it's right on target, and Swift has it after it bounced off her hands. And, but also starting their attack, and then they push their you know four players forward and get a lot of numbers into their offense. Thorson speeding ahead, got through a second player, lets it go, and she scores! Wow, what a finish. Angelina Thorson passing to herself. She said, I got this. Self pass and finish. Nicely done. And the LSU has had some beautiful goals so far in their 18 goals coming into tonight. That's a pretty one there. Just composure and a tough shooting angle. The, don't be fooled by the replay, everybody. To tuck that into the far post, just enough to finish. Beautifully done by Angelina Thorson. Kind of forcing them one way and everybody else. Estes, it got through everybody. The Tigers couldn't jam it home. Torden trying to play it to herself, dashed away by LSU. Bodies hit the ground and you've got to match what, what your opponent is bringing. One edged wide, Glover. We just saw her dancing around before. Neat flick to the top of the 18. A bit behind Baker though. Now Baker's got it back. Left footed boot right at McKamey. You see the strength there by Baker. Molly Baker able to uh, work her way to the top of the box to get that shot off. About 20 yards out. A lot of white jerseys there and they score. The slightest of deflections might have been Sawale. She is off to the races. A huge second goal for LSU. Huge goal, huge celebration by Sawale. Nice header, and Sawale is the one that created that set piece and gets the reward of finishing it. Just skims it enough off her head, able to drive it into the back post, catching McKinney a half second off. And look at the celebration there as she goes racing upfield. I told you, Jeff, a goal was coming. I didn't know which side it was coming from, but you could feel it about to break. Brian digging through, got it out on the turf, but a good sliding sleeve there by Swift. She did not have to go too far to her right. It was right in her wheelhouse. Got it over and Swift out to line it up and catch it. Yeah, just really thrilled. I mean, just an unbelievable performance tonight to come on the road and, and play a great team like Princeton, who just an end-to-end -end game. They tested us. We had uh, great moments, um, obviously a couple of fantastic goals, but just so proud. Um, every time we step up and we give this team a challenge, they rise into the occasion. And I think tonight was a really big test for us um, against a, a top team in the country. But just absolutely thrilled for Lena. She's been sort of our assist maker all season. She's been giving us a laying, laying quite a few on a plate for other people. So to see her get that goal tonight and, and just finish with such confidence was fantastic. And then Cece Wasilla, she doesn't come up with many goals, but when she does, they're, they're typically really big ones. And I think that goal sort of killed off their momentum a little bit and, and gave us that confidence to go on and finish the game. But overall, fantastic performance tonight and uh, we'll enjoy it. And then we'll look forward to a big one versus Rutgers on Sunday.